Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Jenny, and today we're going to have another science read aloud. And the read aloud for today is I'm trying to love spiders. So let's begin. I keep telling myself spiders are cool. I want to love them. Me plus spiders forever. Actually, I love spiders. Let's see how this guy will like spiders too. Let's move on. I mean, spiders have been around for millions of years, moving silently, swinging into action. I want to think of them like bug ninjas. Spider and dinosaur spring break, one hundred sixty-five million BC. That's a long time ago. Let's move on. Like this spider right here. I'm gonna try really hard to like him. Maybe if I study him for a while. Ooh, that spider looks cool. I think it's working. Ah, it's moving. Squish it, squish it, squish it. Done that. Let's move on. That didn't work out. But next time will be better. Well, I'm not too sure. Let's move on. Next time, I'll focus on all the superpowers spiders have, like eight eyes. Extreme close up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. They're right. There is eight eyes. That's cool. And spider webs. Spider webs are cool. Spiders spin webs out of protein-packed spider silk they made themselves. That's awesome. Funnel web, spiral orb web, sheet web. They're awesome. Guys, do you know that these webs? Can actually catch insects that spiders like to eat because of this uh, protein-packed spider silk they make. So let's move on. That's like you or me building a house with our hair, hairball, sweet hairball, and then catching food on it. Food trap, sweet food trap. See, cool. Let's move on. Some spiders even have billions of tiny hair called scapula. On their legs that let them stick on walls or ceilings, or oh my gosh, there's a spider stuck down there! Smash it, squish it, get it right now! Psh. Okay, we're not good at loving spiders just yet. Yeah, you're not. I am. Let's move on. If only spiders were more like things I really love, like burritos and soccer and rocket ship. That would be kind of weird. Imagine a football or a rocket or a burrito just walking up to you. That would be kind of creepy. Like with legs. I mean, like you can never see a soccer ball or a burrito or a rocket ship doing that. Anyway, let's move on. Instead, their closest relatives are also totally gross. Arachnid family reunion. Take scorpion. But it's not like I'm scared of every icky thing. It's just something about spiders. Maybe it's the fact that almost all spiders are venomous. Spiders can't chew very well, much like your baby sister. They need liquid foods, milk, cream corn. Since no one's invented a tiny spider-sized blender, which won't be ever invented, and even if it was, spiders can't use it. It's not gonna be like they can just do it. Spiders rely on their venom to dissolve their dinners, making bugs soft and slurpable. I've always wanted to be a smoothie. Ew, that's gross. But anyway, let's move on. But to be fair, while there are about forty thousand known species of spiders, whoa, that's a lot. Only a few can bite humans, and even fewer can harm you with their venom. Wanted, dead or smashed a lot. Female black widow, brown recluse, red hourglass on underbelly for the female black wind widow, and violet shape marking on its back for the brown recluse. For being poisonous enough to ruin your day. Fatal spider bites are so rare you have a better chance of getting struck by lightning. So spiders aren't that bad. That's amazing. I already knew that. It nice. Let's move on. Oh my gosh! Okay, don't panic. But there's definitely a spider over there. I can't find it. I really can't find it. But anyway, let's move on. And we're not gonna squish it this time, right? We'll just try to pet him, maybe. Can you pet spiders? Let's try. I can pet it. It's amazing. 
Whoops, nope, we squished him. You squished him this time. That's rude. I'm never going to love spiders at this rate. Maybe I should focus on something spiders are good at. Like eating bugs. That's got to be helpful, right? A single spider can eat over 75 pounds of bugs in a year. That's a lot. 75 pounds of bugs. Total grossness. True. 75 pounds of dog. A full-grown boxer. Oh my gosh. A spider could eat this dog for in a year. That's amazing. Like, that's not amazing. Like, it's too much food. By the way, let's just move on. I've even heard that some farmers use spiders to keep harmful insects out of their crops. Yikes! Spiders, fly away! Oh my gosh, they must be scared. And, oh wait, looks like some of those bugs made it over here. Get out of here, bugs. I can't even read my book with all these. Hey, what's that spider doing? Where's the spider? I don't see it. Well, we'll soon find it anyway. Oh, there it is. It's eating all those bad bugs. Thanks, spider. And whoa, look at that. There's a big insect over there. What's that? Let's find out soon. Wow, thanks, little guy. That was really impressive. Spider presents for you. Box of flies. Two spider. Wow, these are amazing. This uh, spider will love it. Let's move on. Oh, did you make that for me? I think I might finally love... Ah! Cockroach! Squish it! Smash it! Make it go away! One thing at a time. Oh my gosh, you're always into smashing insects. Guys, don't do that in real life. It's gross. And even if you do, please wash your hands after that. So that's the end of this video. I hope you like it. Please subscribe to my channel. Share this video with your friends. Give the notification if you want to know if more videos are posted. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.